What is up, guys? This is Pwn Source Rex with Pwn Source Rex Gaming, and today we're going to be discussing the Bitmain Antminer S9 units and whether or not they are worth it in late 2021. Now, currently it is August in 2021, about halfway through the third quarter, but the fourth quarter is coming up very quickly. So, we are going to be looking at the spec sheet from the Antminer website, then we're going to be heading over to asicminervalue.com, and we're going to be looking at the profitability of all of the S9 units all in one little uh, category as of today and look to see what we think about it. All right, so let's head right on over to the spec sheet. Here we are at the S9 units on the Bitmain Amp Miner website. Here we go, this S9 specifications. As you can see, there are many different types of units with different hash rates. You've got the 14 to the 10, and then you go down here and the, here's the power consumption. Those are the two things you're going to need to calculate out your profitability if you are not using something that automatically does it for you. So that's all that matters to you as, an, as a miner, I suppose, unless, of course, you're some engineer or, you, or you're really, really into this stuff. All right, anyway, the, uh, the temperature could be, could be useful, I suppose, and the decibels, the noise is definitely important. You throw this in, in your... Uh, house and your wife is going to strangle you to death um okay so anyway let's move right on over to the s9 uh asic minor value website and we are going to take a look at that website here we go so this is how it is listed you've got all the miners here we are going to go all the way down to the bottom the way they are lined up is most profitable to least profitable but down here at the bottom, you need to set up your local preferences and which is your electrical cost and your currency. So right now it's set to that and it's set to 0 0.1, which we will keep 0 0.1 because, well, that's a standard. It seems to be a standard that I'm seeing. So here we are and we've got all these miners. We're going to type in over here S9 and here is a list of just the S9 units. Now here we are. Here is the Bitmain Amp Miner. 14 that I have. This is what I have. Now these give you the true decibels. This is 85 decibels. Some of them are 76, 145, but this one's 85 decibels. That is super loud. So anyway, we look at this ant miner and it says that the profitability is 328 a day. If you click on the link, It'll bring you into a profitability over time. And as you can see, it is going up, up, up. Now it is going up because, of course, Bitcoin is going up. And as Bitcoin goes up, the profitability is going to go up. Also, um, China stopped mining, or they're trying to put a stop on mining. And um, that probably has a lot to do with it as well. But you can see here, you can see your day, your month, and your year, your total profitability, and according to how you set up your electricity is going to change this profit and the electricity cost. Um, 575 a day, 329. Now, I don't know why this is telling me different than the front page. I'm not sure which one is updated more, um, but you could use another website to, to uh, match it up because that's what I always do. I always double check everything. I don't ever trust one website to tell me the truth. Um, so I would obviously go to a calculator and calculate this right out. Okay, so that is the 14. Let's do one more. Let's take a look at the 13.5 because that seems to be the standard that I'm seeing everywhere right here. Don't mistake it with the S9K because the S9K makes a little bit more money. Okay, so here we are. This one's saying 254. If we go down to the bottom, yeah, the power's set up right. I'm not sure why that's different, but anyway... This is what it's telling me we're going to be doing. And that's that's fine. That's fine. It is going up, which is nice. Okay. So now that we've looked at these units and seen what the profitability is, even though that profitability was different on the two pages, it still gives us a general idea that the profitability is low. It's like 2 to $3 a day, which is nice, but it's not amazing. Um, at this point in time, I personally am not going to be buying any S9 units unless I can get them for like two, three hundred bucks. 
with a power unit able to plug it in and just start using it um as far as uh the current price of them i'm seeing like six seven hundred eight hundred dollars for these units no way i wouldn't even consider that um that is ridiculous i would no no now i wouldn't sell my unit for two or three hundred dollars i wouldn't sell my unit for five hundred dollars um i would keep mine for that because you can just mine it and why sell it if it's making it's making a profit why get rid of it um this isn't like the l3 plus other than maybe some of those miners that are coming out of china because they're trying to sell their miners out um may not be up and running yet so when those go up and running uh the profitability could go down because the difficulty goes up that time will tell us that as well as other other bitmain bitmain or other companies make more miners so guys that that's my thoughts i'm not buying any more of these right now um but as i said this is not financial advice this is just what i am doing uh everybody's got to do what they do you do you so guys if i don't see you in the comments below let me know what you are going to do with the s9 miners let me know what you're going to do down there and if i don't see you in those comments i will see you in the next video